I am thirsting, boys. We're cleaning out the trailer. We're getting ready for a busy weekend. And that means cleaning up the trailer so I can get both Renegades loaded in. I wanna see if we can't get these taillights fixed up on this one, possibly. But we gotta get in here, see if she's gonna fire up and get her out. It's been a little while. I'm by and we have to move the old girl. She needs some work, so I'm thinking we're gonna do some, uh, a little bit of tear down and maintenance over the winter months and maybe let her just relax. Will you come to life for me? No. You're not gonna, hey? Come on. We've got some different stop planned today. We're headed all the way up to Barrie, but we've gotta make some stops on the way. So fill you guys in on what's going on. My buddy Roger there, new to your tires, he called me up uh, a couple months ago and said one of my uh, my buddies wants to commission the shop to do a build mm -hmm. so brand new renegade 2021 XMR renegade with the four lock like uh, we build a lot of side-by-side -side stuff but we'd love assistance on uh, how to put together a wicked ass renegade so of course yeah right on man I'm glad to be involved Jerry buys a bike gets it ordered we started ordering parts I actually um, had Jerry go through Dirty Life for a whack of them, so I'll be stopping there today and picking up some last minute parts on the way up. And Huge shout out to uh, Dirty Life for hooking us up with all the parts. Like I said, it was a lot easier to just do a one stop shop and just be ahead of it. So they made this a lot easier on us, brother. Yeah, really it's been fun working on, with, uh, on a project with you again. Yeah, it is. For a while. I know, it's man. been good. I think we're having some issues with the switch again, which is a real bummer. I suspect that's where our problems are. I think we might have her licked. I think she lives again. Well, that was a pain in the big fat ass. I'm gonna make a couple stops. I'm gonna stop the Bay Marine too. Kingston's Ram headquarters. Or stay tuned rather for details and uh, yeah man, get up to Barry and get on with this build. Cheers. Now here, geez, some of these look like they might just be, well no, that looks alright. That one looks like a little out of shape. Oh You see the boys have got me a little shafted with that tailgate right there. Right, no worries, man, no worries. I hope you have a better afternoon. She decided she was gonna run like a deer off their trailer. Son of a, they did get an early start on it, ripping all the plastics and stuff off. Everything's out of the painters. We got plastics back Check already. Under the light. Oh my lord. With the red flake? Yeah. All the plastics getting automotive paint, a lot of parts are getting powder coated and such. So it's gonna look pretty killer. Uh, super stoked to take you guys with us, so it should be kind of cool. The weather's kind of crappy today, so we're gonna have to stay a little bit concentrated here, focus on uh, what we're doing. Anyways, yeah boys, we'll get back to you here soon. Peter in one freaking piece. In three kilometers, I think that's at 96 feet. The Rebel is on the liquor. She is sucking it up. Straight liquor. Jesus. We definitely need a diesel. There's no doubt about it, man. This is gonna cost me. There's Rogers in it right there. Get back to work! You son of a bitch! Get back to work! I'm lost. I'm not even supposed to be here. Hey, oh, look heart. at those knobby little oh, bastards. Those are fresh. For trail riding? They'd be great for trail riding. Yeah. You know, honest to God, at that width too, it'd yeah. be a good snow tire at that right now. Dude, you keep looking bad at us, man. That wasn't wrapped like that last time I was down, was it? Yeah, it was wrapped, but we didn't have at the lift in it or none of the flares. Or... Holy yeah. shit, eh? Reminds me of the old Pork Masters Jeep. Look at the house. Yes! Oh yeah, bud, you're stocked right up here. Well, it's nothing. 34, 34, 34, 37s, 33s, 32s. Those are probably what we're, we might end up with this time around. Yeah. Uh, holy shit! 
45. There you go. That's <laughs> oh, man. Tit. Oh, my God. Holy shit. We'll get to this here soon. But this is today's uh, project right here. Today, tomorrow, we're going to be working with Jerry and Roger. We got all kinds of parts in the truck. The boys have already got all kinds of parts here. And you can see the fenders are gone. But yeah, Roger got a hold of this. What is this? A 900 General, Roger? 900 uh, Razor 4. This is a four seater Razor? Yeah. It is too, eh? Oh my lord. Have you got like kick out floorboards to be able to get up there, We're man? Sure like, yet. the door's open for this side. So I'm thinking foot there. Yeah. And then climb up into her. And what are they? 42s? 42s. Jesus. Oh, I can't yeah. wait to get you down to the swamp. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's intense. A six inch portal with that's a six inch portal. Lift. Okay, oh, okay. Well, right now we're waiting on uh, rear diff, yeah, clutches, yeah, and uh, the winch plate for the front. Then once that's here, it's we can go full bore on it. Woo. There's the patient. That's called a weight reduction mod right there. Yeah. This is gonna help a great deal having to strip down like this to do some of this work, you know that, so. But we got a lot to rip out and get rid of. Oh, f you ain't got these guards. Well, they'll fit on mine, it's all right. Full skidded. That's what I told you. All for what? Somebody's in for a good deal on some skids. Yeah, it was a last minute decision to swap the color from the yellow. You ever be able to wheelie this thing? Besides you, f see, she barely sit at the back. She's gonna come off. No fucking gap. <laughs> So I think I just probably bonused into some tied up pair of cord. <laughs> we got a little bit of the apple cider. New ninja. Wow. Yeah, you want to be careful with that stuff. All right, well, I want to get my renegade out and get him into the shot. And then we got parts. Let's unload some parts. I think we have everything laid out, boys. Nice. Check it out. <laughs> 21 four lock, brand new Renegade, tore down. S3 arms, STM, RJWC. We got some C5. We got some killer paint going on here. Check this out. Simcoe Auto Collision paint. All kinds of goodies. We got fire mud and floorboards over there, rock lights, halos, you name it. We got RJWC rear, front, axles. This is gonna be killer. Stay tuned. This build was brought to you by the <laughs> got all these tire guys here. They know what they're doing. <laughs> so yeah, sway bar delete. The reason we're doing that guys is because the arms for the 19 through S, uh, S3 are not available yet. At least they weren't to us, so to equip a 34 inch tire, he's had to go back in time. Like Marty McFly, man, 2018 arms from S3. So to do that, we're also having to switch out the axles because of the difference in length. Tie rods, again, all suspension components, right? So this is what it is. This is what it takes to run such a bitching tire, then that's what it takes. Now it should come. There it is. Gonna be reusing the fall joints because we forgot about that, but we're not reusing these bushings. Garage products. Oh yeah, look at holy shit, Raj. She's lofted, bud. Woo! Look at all the wheels, boys. All kinds of shit. Runners, 20 inch, those are the ones I'm toasting. Yeah, 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 yeah. They're killer crazy. We should take a look at those. We should crack a box. Look at that. Awesome. This is a beauty. They are, you're right. Like if you took that and you painted all that milling yellow, that neo yellow, it would just be intense. Yeah. Look at all the wheels. Look at all the wheels, man. 18s, 14s, even 12s, boys. For you old school buggers that are still running a reasonable uh, tire, the rest of us are just insane. Roger's really insane. It gets worse every time I visit. It gets like a bigger tire every time, eh? Yes. <laughs> I would like uh, two large pizzas. One with double cheese and pepperoni. 
and one Hawaiian. You tape and you make sure you wrap this nice and good where the header's gonna come by. This one's got 49%. Well, hold on, let's let's show the boys here. Look at this thing, it's stripped right the hell down. Full header, full system, RJWC mud edition. Everything is pretty much buttoned up. The battery's still connected. All right, Jerry, Ready? let's get a sound clip. Seco Racing. But anyways, all right, we got RJ stopped in here, and because we've got the plastics, everything off the bike, we're not going to be taking the easy route this time of drilling speed holes, because we have enough room to feed our halos right through there without doing any mods. So, okay. These sleeves in the top of the Rocks risers, yes. they go on the bottom. Yeah, they go first. The other thing is you see these tabs on them. Yep. They got ground off. Love grinding shit. Right here, to here, this yep. line comes up, and the bracket actually. The T junction bolt, right? So you've pulled that out. I pulled that out, but if yep. you down in there, that junction, those lines hit the bottom of this bracket. It only gives you. So what I was thinking. Yeah, that's about all you got. This off, yep, you sure. And rotate it down. I've done that as well, but you also just want to loosen up here and bring the whole reservoir in. Mm -hmm, yeah. Uh huh. Just a couple ways to pull in a little bit of slack. And I mean, there's not much to work with, boys. I know it's tired. This is where we at. We got our uh, we got our neutrinos installed, and then we've got our four mud halos laid into place. Um, over here, we got tires going on here. Rear swing arms are in. Axles are all changed. All the HD demons. We got the belt cover all buttoned back up. Exhaust system all buttoned back up. We're starting to move into the rad relocate now. Um, front suspension's all in place. This uh, S3 arms just look killer tie rods that are uh, obviously the right length 
Also got the poison kit on there just for extra cooling, boys. Why wouldn't you, right? Working out the details of this relocate. Once we drill holes, plastics, and stuff like that, I can get these floorboards situated. We're pretty much down to the nitty gritty. We got all kinds of our JWC and uh, OMD mods here, and uh, rocks risers are in, Seco stem is in. So we're not that far off, but we still do have a lot of work left. So we'll get her buttoned up, and uh, yeah, that's where we're at. We've been plowing right, through, guys. boys. We've been plowing through. Heat back plastics are going on. Dino Jet Flash in place. She's ready. This thing's going to be an animal, Jerry. It's going to be an absolute animal. It's not going to feel anything like when you when you last just tested it. You know. It's going to be a demon. Yeah, absolutely. So we just got to stab our headlights in. We got to stab our tail lights in. We got to run our wiring for our rock lights and our halos. But uh, all in all, the boys have already got this kind of mocked up. Holes are drilled in the plastic, so uh, we'll throw floorboards on at the end, of course. Just about done. Project Demon, he says. They're going to look deadly. Something's not right. <laughs> but that's how they're supposed to look, and I think that's hitting your brakes, right? Are they looking deadly? Oh, they're definitely going to be deadly. We just got to get them to match. <laughs> We're really just buttoning it up here now, folks. Wiring is all coming together. Uh, we just got to run out our rock lights. Oh. Yo. Pair your phone to them and do some stuff. Yeah. Play around with them a little bit. Oh, yeah. It's almost as nice as that one. Way to build a monster over two days, eh? Absolutely. Absolutely, brother. A lot of hard work from all the boys. But I think it's worth it. To satisfy that woman. Little David Wilcox, Canadian as Canadian gets, eh? She's looking killer. So all we gotta do now is bleed off the cylinders, straighten out a little bit of wiring, throw the nose cone on. Sticker time, man. A couple stickers. This thing looking fresh. Maybe a little white down to polish. All right, we'll bleed her up and then we'll fire her up, boys. We'll be back. The first decal to go on. Yeah, buddy. This is one killer ride, Jerry. Oh, Jesus. Absolutely stunning. Wow, man, she pops, yeah. Are you happy she's finally done, bud? I know, you've been bugging me for two months. We gotta get this bike built, man. There's no fucking parts are coming, parts aren't coming. Jesus, parts are coming. <laughs> totally. He's like, you know what? All the parts are here. I have them neatly organized in a Ziploc bag within a Ziploc bag. <laughs>
was crazy. Bring this down for the boys. Tuckered out. Definitely need a good sleep. How rip are you, bud? At back 40 ATV, check it out, boys. Looking pretty, man. Dino jet, demon axles, RJWC just about everywhere on the machine. Rick Seacoast, steering stem, we got rocks risers, poison water pump cooler, obviously C Fab. What else? Full set of clutches, FDM, primary and secondary, the old Race 3P. You got yourself 34s on 18s, EFX Moto Havocs from New to You Tires, along with some fuel wheels, 18 inch fuel compressors. We got the far mud floorboards, he's got the back rack on the way, far mud and halos, far mud and rock lights. A lot of powder coat work, as you boys can see. Springs out, rad was out, wheels were out, back bumper went out, RJWC lights, we got some DRV add ons, you're looking at skid plates. Back uh, diff protector. Yeah, I'll probably forget a few things, but uh, there's so much going on. Original mods on the old shifter. You got heavy duty tie rods, I can't remember what company. Garage product bushings, like, man, oh man. What a weekend, eh, brother? Yeah. That was awesome. <laughs> Yeah. 
good one. Oh, look at that axle. Wow. Raj. Your four wheels come off. You come off the ground there a little bit. As long as your four wheel high, you can take air. You can lock everything Absolutely. and then unlock. For us though, it's a little everywhere out yeah. there. You're blowing Hold a belt. ship this is the clutch that's the one brake and nothing on the bars just ridiculous man that sounds wild wow. and then the back brake is on the sprocket too wow. so everything's on one side nothing on the other that's so the brake so and the clean sprocket. eh yeah She's a bike built for one of the boys. This killer, man. You guys fucking, this thing's killer. Yeah, we built this and then uh, one of my best friends that worked with me. Yeah, he's just telling me. Yeah. yeah. No, oh, that's killer. Memorial build. Killer memorial build. You got good taste other than the Polaris squad reflecting, but uh, <laughs> I dig it, brother. That's awesome. Thanks for the show.
for those tires even it's like holy shit that's soft that's a lot of snow she's full of bore or no bore my lord suitable choice got some MSAs from Raj and they're out uh, getting ready for powder coat give them a little custom touch but uh, I think that will be killer man tough to beat for sure right on what a freaking weekend Tucker it was a good time freaking awesome the group of guys down here a1 love pounding up the big snow drifts we're at his home I'm gonna have to look up directions to get home because I have no idea where we are. Jerry's built back for the ATV. Great. Turned out good, man. I mean, there's uh, not a lot more you can do in the way of bolt-ons unless you're going like four rolls. And, but uh, no, it was awesome. Oh, three hours and 40 minutes. Boys, we're almost four hours from home. These guys brewing up some sweet moonshine. You gotta take some of this home with you. Well, yeah, I would love a jar. Thank you. <laughs> My God. 
<laughs> the guy's got one hell of a killer shine. Like, my God, some of the smoothest tasting stuff. Two different flavors, a lemonade flavor and uh, apple uh, apple cider. And jump. Roger and his crew working with the boys. That was a lot of fun. And I actually had a riot hanging out down here. Got a good group of guys, man. Good group of guys. A lot of parts there, so it was nice to, have, to get her done in two days. It was perfect, actually. Not two full days either. Like, I didn't even show up in the Barry until the afternoon. It was like already shop time closed. Good times with the boys. <laughs> smooth clutches, man. Those STMs, super smooth. Yeah, got the jam. When you crack her, did you see him stand that thing up? Yeehaw. Yee freaking haw.